Alright, welcome back this is to uh, Pokemon Ruby, episode 19. We're going to go to our next destination. The underwater cave, it seems, but really our next destination is another island town. Where we'll have our seventh... This is the stretch of the game that I don't like so much. More than half of it is water. And with water comes random encounters all the time. That guy, you turn in those shards to him for like stones. And now we reach our next destination, Moss Deep City. Uh, we're gonna take on the gym in a minute. If they let us into the gym, I'm not sure if this is one of the cities with prerequisites. It's a, it's not. This gym, I'm gonna screw up so much here. what this does. Nothing. Let's see what this does. And this. What's this? Oh, this is good. Yeah. My Absol Pwn's faces. You're gonna want to touch the switch. And now we're gonna go back over here. And go up. Now we'll continue on. Okay. Now there's another switch. Let's flip it. Now what's gonna happen? Go down. Another switch. Flip. <sighs> Back to the Aeneid for Virgil. Now we're going to start this gym over again. Loop. And we've reached the gym leaders. I didn't screw up that badly. Alright, this is a double battle gym. So, choose two Pokemon that you think will do well. Uh, they have all Psychic Pokemon, and they both have Psychic Rock Pokemon, too. And they have freaky tele 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 telepathy. And they each have only one Pokemon, which we completely overpower, which is kind of sad. I overtrained uh, Leaf Blade. Basically how to take on this gym if your Pokemon aren't so high level is to try and use physical attacks uh, like never mind that would be like a diamond pearl strategy. Fail, don't listen to me. Um
don't be afraid to send out a fighting type. Even, um... They don't really use their psychic type moves that often. They mainly just combine spam or solar beam spam. Or hyper potion spam. Which is annoying. And eventually... They'll just give up on the hyper potions like every other gym leader. And you can just pwn them in the faces. Like that. Shattered him. My batch. And now you can use dive. Which I completely forgot where you obtain it. So we're after this battle. I mean, after I leave this gym, we're gonna go on a wild goose chase for f dive. Everything keeps wording out wrong. Okay. That guy appraises your Pokemon and Poke Blocks. Steven. You ought to give me dive, right? Yeah. Second try, not so bad. And now we can dive. And now would be a good time for me to get a wa an actual water type instead of a Linoon. I think I might... Oh, no, no. I'm going to a water type and if I don't have one I haven't played this game in a while my diver okay I just caught its hint of cruel and I had cool I evolved it and raised its level to 50 now we're gonna surf down here this little strip right here this is where the cave is this little uh, strip right here has a cave just dive and then you'll reach underwater, which was, in my opinion, was one of the coolest parts of this game. And I wish it would return sometime. Uh, anyway, we navigate around here, trying to find the cave. Or at least I navigate around here trying to find the cave. It's kind of difficult. Uh, well, not really difficult. It's just it's not really usually difficult. takes me a while. Mike's repeating like half the stuff I say. Alright, here's the cave. Woo! Loud woo is loud. There's our little submarine. Press B. Reach the surface. Okay. Now, next episode, we're gonna go in this cave and we're gonna take on Team Magma once and for all.